The judge and advocacy groups say they agree to modify the city's right to shelter law, allowing the city to limit the amount of time some asylum seekers can stay in shelter. It's important to point out that these modifications are only temporary and will last only until the current humanitarian crisis ends. The underlying right to shelter law still remains in effect, so both sides are actually claiming victory. Today is indeed a historic day. Deputy Mayor Ann Williams Isom announcing that after months and months of negotiations, the city reached an agreement with legal aid and homeless advocates to allow some flexibility in housing asylum seekers. With 180,000 already arriving in the city and more expected, the migrant agreement, which applies only to adults seeking shelter, limits the amount of time an adult can stay in shelter to 30 days and not reapply unless they're extenuating circumstances or the person is making a good faith effort to find a place to stay outside the shelter system or the person receives a reasonable accommodation, like the person is pregnant or has a disability. The agreement allows younger adults under the age of 23 to stay for 60 days and allows the city to continue a reticketing program to help more people move out of shelter. It does not apply to families with children, which according to city figures make up 78 percent of the 64,500 people who are in City shelters as of Thursday.